billion Ghana if you do not already know. And this is my YouTube channel. Oh, okay, that is somehow the same. But yes, this is welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm 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 overly excited to have you guys here. Did I say excited or excited? I'm very excited. I'm learning to speak better English by the way. Um, for so long, I wanted to have a uh, not just not just a YouTube channel, a platform really where I could um, you know share and talk, hear videos, and just you know talk about things that um, things that I can relate with, things that happen to me as a believer, as a young female believer living in Nigeria. Yeah. Um, for, for a while, really, I remember when I was in law school, that's 2017, I even went as far as um, <coughs> creating like a spreadsheet, but the topics I wanted, who I wanted to handle the topics, sometimes because I, I wanted to have a talk show actually, but somehow I didn't start. Uh, why? I think two reasons really. One, I, I didn't feel I had the technical know-how and um, the technical um, things that I needed. I didn't have a phone, I didn't have a camera, I didn't have light, I didn't have... My, I, I sure did not have, yeah. So I felt like okay, it's not time. I didn't feel good enough. I didn't think that I had anything to say, or that anyone listened to what I had to say, or I didn't think that my my experiences, my opinions, my understanding were valid. I felt like yeah. And guess what? It's been th three years. It's been more than three years. But I'm counting three years of law school, yeah, because that's that's like the definite time I could remember. But it's been three years down since late and I still do not have technical though, I still don't have a info. I still don't have a good phone enough like, like I would love to use. I, I'm shooting in, in my friend's studio. Thank you. Shout out to Victor Samo Yeah. Okay. I am um, I still don't have equipment, yeah, three years after. And I still do not funny enough, I still don't think that my opinions matter. I almost I almost won't feel that I'm worse than I was three years ago. And guess what? That's the last thing that not make us start and like the title of this book is the messiness of starting I, i've come to uh, realize that starting is messy no one ever no matter how much clear you you have something planned out even a business plan you have your business model you know what you want to do truth is as you start things begin to change and you change what you started as if you're doing something really you know, concrete no one figures it out before they start and i've been waiting to figure it out there are a lot of things that people need to hear there are a lot of things people are going through that me just saying it would help, yeah. And uh, I'm tired of waiting for everything to be perfect. So I'm starting with all the mess involved, with not being sure, with all the uncertainty. And that's I think that's one that one thing I want to encourage you on. Start, start. If all you have is I want to sell earrings, you don't know whether you want to produce yet. You don't know whether you want to um, um, sell gold or silver um, or steel earrings. Just Go to the market, buy your ring, and start selling. In the process, I, I mean, you have the Holy Ghost, and there's if you're if you're a believer, you have the Holy Ghost, and there's a certain level of certainty it would give you, but you won't have everything figured out. I remember that <clears throat> my pastor, I attended my uh, Soul City Church in Warri here, and I still worry by the way. I, I remember he used to say that when we were going to start church four years ago, a lot of the things that we're doing now in church, we didn't know, we didn't think we were going to do. We didn't think we were going to have a campus expression, we didn't think we were going to have a record level. But hey, we have it now, you know, and God knows what we're going to have tomorrow. If God says, hey, tomorrow we'll do this, we're going to do it. So that's how you, you start. I don't know what yeah, the at the you have to start a business, it could even be a blog, uh, a podcast. Start, it gets easier, really. Um, I think I saw a quote somewhere by Marie Paul, where she said that clarity comes from engagement, not thought. And it makes sense, you know, we get more clarity, we get more clarity as we engage more. You know, the more we engage, the more clarity we get, the more things, oh, okay, I shouldn't have done it this way, I should have done it that way. Why? Because you engage, not because you sound angry. You can't think, you can't think all, uh, think through all the scenarios. You can't, <laughs> you're, you, are, you are limited to your experience, your knowledge, you can't think it through, yeah? So, this is me starting. Then I think it was Tolu Akwa Dejimo that said that, um, God finishes before he starts, yeah, and that just, that struck me, you know, God finishes before he starts, doesn't mean that you as a human, God, God, God what that means is that God sees the end from the beginning, but you might not see the end from the beginning, but you know what the beginning looks like, just start. And Scripture says in Hebrews 5.14 that strong meat are for those who by the reason of you exercise their, their services, really the truth is you get better as you do. 
as you do rather. Like as the more you engage, the more you know what to do and what not to do. If you start a business, a business and you fail, should you you are the uh, owner of the failed business, and that's better than the owner of the new business or the new business at all because you know what to do now, you know what to do better, you know how to go about certain things. So I like just have you start. Then one more thing, guys, on this thought is the fact that a lot of times some of us are we don't know what we want to do because we are set, we're not aware of ourselves. We are set unaware, is that what? I don't know. But we are not aware of self. And we're not aware of self because we don't try things. Sometimes is in is in trying something that you know, like, okay, this is not for me. But if in your head today I, I think I want to sew. The day after tomorrow, I think I want to be photographer. The day after the day after tomorrow, you go like, mm, nah, I think I should be um, a doctor. But you don't try any of these things. Truth is, they, might, they will just all end up being things you wished for. They will never become actionable. They will never be, become, um, this is what I am, or I tried this before, I know it's not for me. So if you are in a place where you're not so sure, in a place where you, you have a lot of ideas that you are confused on, this is something I started to do. So I'm not even doing something that I started like a, a month ago. I had some different things here and there, and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to start it. Instead of staying, because I can, I've, I've stayed there forever. I would do this, try this, try this, and guess what? Time has gone. I've not done anything. But if you start, even if you're not sure, but it's something shaky, you will, you will, you will figure it on the way that okay, this is for me or this is not for me. You get? So guys, really, um, yes to my YouTube channel. Cheers. Uh, you can get your own. This is what I like. You get what I want to say. Cool. But not too much sugar. This is coming from someone that is sugar. It's not good. And we're all going to stop it together. So yes, my YouTube channel and um, uh, get ready to be challenged. Get ready to be lashed at sometimes. Get ready to grow. Yes, growth is major for me because I'm, I, I know I'm going to grow in this process. And that's what, what, what I, I desire most for you. Get ready to, uh, for, for some tables to be shaking. Like, do we, the table. Um, I fall down, like the, the table will shake and destroy, your legs will break and um, get ready to, to laugh, yeah, get ready to just do life together. I hope to be in a community of um, young, up and mobile believers that are, you know, living their everyday lives as much as they can as believers. Um, uh, I, I, do I need to say that it's a fake channel? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm a believer, so everything that I do really revolves around that, so it doesn't have to be a fake channel. For, that um most importantly this this is not going to be a vlog for my personal opinion really if there's one thing i keep saying is that god is the center of my life and i thought his word the bible is the front law for my life it's the front of the jew that's a difficult time to say that it's, it's the origin so everything i do um i'm i'm wrong you're wrong we are all wrong just what is right yeah, that's that's our that's going to be our standard around here. So even when I share my experiences, I'm sharing it for you as soon God's word. So if my experience is God's word, if my experience goes against God's word, I'm sharing it to say that hey, this is what God said, this is what I did, and come on, this is how I got into trouble. Yeah? So my opinion is not what matters. And even when people come up here, their opinion is not what matters. God's word is what we're trying to push at the end of the day because that's what matters to us. So yeah, guys, I'm, I'm really excited. I might not look Ha <laughs> ha! I do not show excitement like that, but I am so glad to start this journey. Please share, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share, like this video, uh, for your friends to watch and like and share. Comment, yeah, your comments mean more to me actually because I want to hear your thoughts. I want to hear that some of these things are you can relate. I don't want to speak to the air. I don't want to just <laughs> make videos randomly. I want to talk to people that can relate, people like me not like me but if and even if you if have, if you have a disagreement with you i also love to hear it so please i all means comment so welcome to the family by the way i'm going to cover it with you i mean i know that it's so bland but i just like it and it makes me laugh so uh cover it with you it's not about me really about god and i hope to point men to the father at the end of the day no matter what you're talking about but don't talk about stuff that and this is not a doctrinal platform yeah that I, I believe that's what the local church is for. So go to church, have a look at church. This is, you know, where we talk about things that we go to really from practical stance. So, yeah, you might not like some of the things you get, but if you 
if you're really uh, if you're an open person or if you're a truthful person yes especially as a believer you, you know that same truth so yeah not my opinions we're going to cast down any position that does talk about this one yeah i think we're going to start praying and feeding the dog so we're going to end it now <laughs> so guys yeah welcome to the to, to the family um videos will be up like next week the, the week where this one comes up other videos will come up we have one video for each week sometimes i will do you have just me sometimes i have friends and people that i respect come and join me on the second time so thank you very much please like subscribe share kawaii greetings uh bye